This morning, we are here to meet the head of state, to signify our commitment, our support for him, for the daily fight that he is fighting. Of course, women are not on the battlefield, but in our hearts, in our hearts, in our homes, every night and all day long, women are mobilized in prayers and in their fingers so that peace returns to Burkina Faso. This is the purpose of our audience this morning. And we pray to the Almighty, the All-Merciful, that all those who will not accompany him in the fight against the terrorists, may the Almighty reveal them to us. Or who is hiding them, reveal them to us on the day that we know who is who and know where to go to conquer our territory. Our message is that the Almighty flashes them on the right path, that they put pity in their hearts and that together we manage to bring them to lay down their arms together that we manage to instill in them an education that will allow them to be more human towards their fellow men and especially for the peace of their homeland that they manage to lay down their arms and listen to their mother. Oh, this is so touching. This is um, prayer from some women, Muslim women, visited President Ibrahim Traore this morning. And this is a word of prayer. They made trying to pray that God should expose all those perpetrating evil, all those who do not want Bokeda Faso to know peace, all those who are fighting against the peace of the land. And then again, they also t- talked about them laying down their arms so that they will be show- shown the way to proper education, which is very important. They made an emphasis that women are not in the battlefield, but in their homes, in their hearts, they are interceding. They are praying for the peace of the land, which is very, very good support. And we hope that those prayers will be answered one day. Peace that they desire will be restored in their homeland. Thank you again for your time with me. I don't take it for granted. Hope to see you in my next as I come your way again with more trending news. Bye.